Stay home, be safe. That's the word from city leaders. Tensions are escalating just days before a White Lives Matter rally in Murfreesboro. Now disturbing new graffiti has turned up just off the town square. And as News Channel 5's Nick Barris tells us, more merchants there plan to stay closed on Saturday. So who will be here on the square on Saturday? We know there will be some protesters, but who else? The thing is, some businesses are going to be open, others are going to be closed. The Woods Viking Barbershop is right there on the square. Owner Sean Templeton says they may cut 200 heads on a Saturday, but... We went to a downtown meeting uh, with the mayor and the, and the police chiefs, and they were talking, they were expecting the worst. So Templeton won't open on Saturday. Definitely, definitely going to cost us some money uh, to shut down, but the safety of our customers, that's the most important thing for us. Several white nationalist groups plan to rally downtown off the square from 11 to 4. Counter protesters are expected to gather as well. One haircut customer says some of those counter protesters are coming from as far away as the West Coast. So I have a couple of friends that are coming out from the San Francisco Bay Area. Many now find that hotels are booking up for the weekend. Of course, some involved are already here. Merchants just found this white supremacist graffiti defacing a building off the square. This was covered up fast in a day best in the day. So that's how real this is. Real enough for the district attorney. Where it gets my attention is when it becomes an illegal act. That's vandalism and potentially violence. Jennings Jones says police will be on the square Saturday in full force. He hopes everyone else will stay home. My advice would be to avoid the downtown area for that afternoon. The bottom line from law enforcement, they just like to see people stay away, ignore what's going on here on the square on Saturday, but they doubt that'll happen. They just want to make sure people stay safe. In Murfreesboro, Nick Barris, News Channel 5. Nick, thanks. And a similar rally with counter protests is expected from 11 to 1 p.m. Saturday in Shelbyville. 